The argument over whether to designate a Bloomington house as a historic site became a moot point last night as Bloomington residents and city officials saw two very different visions for the city came into conflict. As WTIU's Kyle Clayton reports, one is the integrity and preservation of the historic neighborhoods, and the second is the city's need to meet an increase in Indiana University student housing demands. Chris Bamba, along with his family, owns the bungalow in the 700 block of North Walnut. He wants to move the house and construct apartments marketed for students. Bamba says the property has been sitting mostly vacant for the better part of two years and he's losing money on it. But whether he's allowed to move the house depends in part on whether the house is historic. The city's historic commission has asked the council to designate the area a historic spot, which if the council approves it, would prevent Bamba from moving the house. I don't think the house is historic. I think it's a cool house. I, it, having the house destroyed, was n torn down, was never on the table. Never asked for it, never wanted it. The home is known as the Burns House because it belonged to a prominent businessman named Roy Burns in the early 1900s. Bamba said if he's allowed to move the house, he would keep it in the neighborhood. The city council is scheduled to vote on it next week. For WTIU News, I'm Kyle Clayton.